This is on the art of staying with what you're doing. So one of the primary principles and components of mindfulness is clear intentionality and direction. Now you have a gen you can have a general and also at the same time a specific intention. So within the awareness of the breath your general intention is to come into experience rather than be detached and observing from a distance. It's very general, but very clear as well. Uh, you get to know over time when you're in experience and when you're just sort of away or thinking, noting mentally, oh, there's the breath, now it's rough, now it's smooth, now it's coming in, now it's going out. But it's all kind of in your mind. The, the aim in the mindfulness is to come into the actual experience. So the mind is working. It might say, oh, it's slow or it's fast or it's a bit rough. But it's actually that thought or those thoughts are connected with the actual experience. So once you connect with the experience of the breath, you then have the primary, the other primary or the next primary component, which is staying with it. And of course, in a way, this is the most difficult thing because the mind might want to hop or jump or close off. So staying with it, staying with the breath is uh, not all that easy. So there are a couple of tips and skills and tools that help with the process of staying with. So one is that previously, before the meditation, you would have mentally cleared your mind and said, well, I'm not going to think about those things or I'm going to notice if I'm thinking about those things and let go of them, they're not relevant, I'm going to stay with the breath. So it's a very clear clearing of those things and intentionality. So that really helps. Another aspect of or skill is anchoring. Once you actually have the experience of the breath, you just drop in the word here. So the word here, it, as it were, fixes you, not too literally fixes you, but sticks you, <laughs> <laughs> Not too literally sticks you, but lets you stay with the experience. So the, the word here and the experience of here in the breath come together. So the mind is anchoring you in the experience. Now, of course, the reason I'm saying not literally sticking or staying or fixing is because the experience of the breath is changing. But you're staying with that changing experience. So you're anchoring with the thought here into that experience. Or it could be the actual place that you're focusing on. The nostrils. Or the lungs. Or the belly. Or the lower belly. So the words are anchoring you into that experience. And then you might actually extend that to say, stay, stay here. So in that way, there's a clear directive and anchoring into the experience. And the mind is helping you stay with that experience. Now, part of the, the process is the mind starts to relax and settle into the experience. So that then becomes something you can stay with. You notice that you're much more calm, quieter, settled, clearer, for example, uh, more settled, and you stay with it. You stay with that together with the experience of the breath. So the settled feeling of the mind and the experience of the breath come together. 
Now, in the same way that you can anchor your attention onto the breath using words, you can do the same thing with the, the quality of the mind. You can actually say, still. So, not as a command, but actually, it's still. <laughs> Stay here. It's still. Stay. And then you just start to get this sense of staying with a quality that is the result of becoming more involved and absorbed in the breath. So rather than jumping away and saying, oh, that's really great, I got constant, oh, I lost it. You stay with it. You keep bringing your attention back to both the breath and the quality of engagement uh, and settledness into the breath and you have and they come together and you stay with that there's a, a sort of wholeness a quality of being complete when the two the object and your mind come together and that is a, a very important aspect of mindfulness it's not just you noticing or watching something it's you being wholly completely absorbed and permeated in that thing so you stay with it you stay with that process and that allows that involvement and engagement to deepen you go more into it and there is more of a sense of engagement and satisfaction by being with it so there's just a few words on the skills of staying with the breath.